Tonight at 10 o'clock, Mobile Police Department is investigating an increase of people shooting into occupied buildings. Police say there were six shootings into occupied buildings and cars last week. Here's News 5's Dana Winter. If it happens one time, it's more than likely going to happen a second time if we don't take that person into custody. Mobile police say four occupied buildings and two occupied cars were shot into last week. Chief Lawrence Batiste says most of these shootings are not random. Find one stray bullet in your house, maybe it was an accident. If there's th 5, 10, 13 rounds into your home, that, that tends to tell you a different story. Batiste says we're seeing more of this type of crime than usual. Police believe some of these shootings could be linked together. Two of the six uh, appear to potentially be, be related incidents. While investigating this type of crime, Batiste tells us the hardest thing for officers can be getting information from victims. If they don't help us catch those individuals that are shooting at them, they're going to keep shooting at them until they get them or some random person uh, that may have been in your home because they're shooting into a specific home. It's not going down the block and spraying every house on the block. Batiste tells News 5 officers are investigating everyone involved in the shootings to figure out who's behind them. We're looking at the victims to see if there's a connection between the victims uh, in these particular incidents. We're also looking at potential suspects to see if there's any nexus between the victims and the suspects in any of these cases. And that was Dana Winter reporting. Chief Batiste says the best thing to do if you're hearing gunshots nearby is to get to a safe place in your house, take cover, and call police.